Greetings, this is Amy Wentley with Chai Knuckles Knitting. This video covers the two row bind off. This is one of a series of videos covering bind offs that you can use for knitting. And a link to the playlist is in the description below and on my blog at chinucklesknitting.com. To work the lace bind or the two row bind off, you'll start like you would a traditional bind off. So you're going to go ahead and knit a stitch and then you're going to purl a stitch and then take the yarn to the back and you're going to lift the knit stitch over the purl stitch and you're going to leave that purl stitch there. Then you are going to knit the next stitch and purl the next stitch. Take the yarn to the back and you're going to lift the knit stitch over the purl stitch. So now you have two purl stitches on your right hand needle. So now you're going to knit the first stitch and purl the next stitch and you're going to lift the, the knit stitch over the purl stitch and you now have three purl stitches on your needle. Then you're going to knit the next stitch and purl the next stitch you'll lift the knit stitch over the purl stitch and now you have four purl stitches on your right needle and one more time you're going to knit the next stitch, purl the next stitch and then you're going to lift the knit stitch over the purl stitch. So that is going to leave you with <coughs> um, five purl stitches on your right hand needle. So turn your work and then you are going to slip the first two stitches purl wise onto your right needle and you're going to lift the first stitch over the second stitch and then slip the next purl stitch purl wise and lift the first stitch over the second stitch and slip the next stitch purlwise and lift the first stitch over the second stitch and then slip the last stitch purlwise and slip the first stitch over the second stitch. So it's called a two row bind off because it takes you two rows to finish it. So then you will cut your yarn at the end of this or actually you won't. What you need to do in this case is you will need to um, sew this loop down onto your knitting when you're done. So you can either, you can take just an extra piece of the yarn that you have on hand, um, thread it through a darning needle and just sew that down to the edge. And that gives you a decorative edge with this kind of eyelet feel here. So you can see there are, there are holes there in the bind off that make it kind of lacy looking. So please check out more of my videos and I will see you soon. Bye.